Hello and welcome to my channel. My name's Ali and this here is Bunsen. And in today's video I'm going to be talking about whether a chinchilla can live a full and happy life with just three limbs. And in short answer, yes they can. This is Bunsen and this is her story. So Bunsen was born with us many many years ago and when she was eight or nearly nine weeks old she broke her leg really really badly she had a freak accident on a cage that was actually given to us by a show breeder so it was a safe cage but um, she still managed to get her leg caught in the wire um, and she got it caught quite badly and where she was trying to pull at it she'd actually really seriously mangled her leg um, so we had to cut the wire away from her leg rather than try and pull it out because we didn't want to do any more damage and we took her to a vet. The vet said to us they could try splinting it but because she was so young, she was only eight weeks old and because she was so small they suggested that it probably wouldn't work at all and the, probably the kindest thing to do would be to remove her leg. They said her, her chances of survival were about 30%, so that's not great odds. But she had the operation, she came out of that fine. Luckily she made it out of recovery. She had to wear one of those collars that's similar to a dog collar, but they had to make it especially for her because they didn't have one that fitted her because she was so small. I don't think they'd ever operated on a chinchilla that small before that young. And she had to have antibiotics and painkillers. So because of that she lost quite a bit of trust with me to begin with because it was just like I was manhandling her and she was in pain but she gradually got her trust back with me whenever you move a limb from an animal it puts the animal's body under just a little bit more strain which is why they said the lifespan would probably be shortened but she's now 13 years old and still going strong to this day. She's not in any pain. I monitor very closely because obviously her other joints are under a lot of strain. One thing I will say is where she used to have her leg, once the fur came back through, on her, where her leg used to be, she has a habit of chewing the fur around that area and she does it to the other side as well. And it's just like when you have, uh, when you bite your nails, it's a habit that you can't, sometimes you just can't break and that's what it is with her. She's just perfectly happy, perfectly healthy, but she just has a habit of chewing her fur and she has done that for the last 13 years. So apart from that, she's happy and fine. Um, I'm going to show you how she moves now because some people might want to see how a chinchilla with three legs actually moves about, how she gets about. 